Hey, how are you doing? Welcome to the channel. In today's video, I want to talk about a bitter, weird experience that I had in the first final exam week in pharmacy school, which which hurt me, and which was very unexpected. And like with that experience, I understood that uh, pharmacy school is way harder than what I expected and what I thought. So before uh, telling the story, if you guys don't know me, my name is Saba and I'm a first year pharmacy student here in Tehran. Our second final exam was molecular biology, which was a hard topic for me. I studied that during the term, like a part of it, and I studied all of it again uh, two or three days before exam. Like all I did just uh, a couple of days before exam was studying molecular biology but because it was so much and so hard uh, no matter how much I study I always felt like I don't know anything I don't understand I don't learn and I don't recall anything and worst of all I mix the things I've learned and I've memorized so what do I do I, I felt so stressed out because uh, imagine you study so hard and you have a final exam and your grades matter uh, and you don't want to fail the exam but you feel like you're gonna fail the exam so I, I felt so bad so anxious because like I say I constantly I was telling myself that you're not ready you're not enough you don't remember anything you're gonna fail and uh, like although I was telling these things to myself but I still was studying as much as possible but you know I still felt bad and so I'm talking about the night before exam. It's 1 a.m. and I'm still studying like all the notes, all the questions. I'm just solving them, them again. And the thing that I get, I'm like, girl, I am not able to answer all of the questions. Like there are some questions I don't know. What do I do, girl? So it made me feel worse because like my exam was at 8 a.m. and it was 1 a.m. at night and I felt like I, I don't I don't know what to do so I just I told myself let's take a little nap because I couldn't sleep eight hours that night because I had an exam so I slept at 1 a.m. and I uh, woke up at 4 30 like three and a half hours of sleep is not enough and especially when you're feeling bad uh, I was feeling sick the morning like it's 5 a.m. and I feel so sick I couldn't eat anything uh, but I need to eat something because I did not have any energy because I didn't have didn't get enough sleep I didn't anything so and I am very stressed out because I I think I don't remember I don't recall anything I mixed the stuff I have studied so uh, I, I drank a little bit of water like a little small amount of water and I vomit that and that was when I understood, girl, this is gonna be hard. Uh, so, like, in that moment, I wasn't even thinking about grades. I just wanted to be able to get there and be able to take the exam, no matter what my grade is. Um, I, I vomit four or five times before getting to the faculty to take the exam. Uh, I got an over for myself at 6 30 things um and i because i didn't want to get there by bus i didn't want to worry about getting late so uh i was there on time but like people around me my classmates that were studying uh but i couldn't do anything i was sitting there uh staring at the floor i wasn't even able to breathe properly i was hungry i was thirsty um and <laughs> five minutes to exam i was vomiting in the restroom any moment i could have fainted uh but so it's gone everything happened happened i was there i was taking the exam but when i took the exam there was a question i knew the answer the other question i knew the answer the other question i knew the answer and that is one, the, the thing i want to share with you that if you study for an exam you are gonna answer some of the questions i don't say i don't promise every single question but you are able to answer some questions but the pressure uh, that stress i was putting on myself made me feel so stressed out and so sick and uh 
feel so bad. So it was my fault. It was my mind that was kept telling me, you're not enough. You haven't studied enough. You're not ready. You're going to fail. But I didn't fail. I, I answered some questions. I don't think I get. Well, I will just get the best grade. But it was good enough. And that was all in my mind. The next time I'm taking an important exam, which I worry a lot about the grades I'm passing, I'm gonna remember if I study, I'm gonna pass. So worrying a lot and putting so much stress is never ever gonna help anyone. So um, our mind, our mindset is as important as our knowledge for every single exam. Uh, that was an experience I wanted to share with you that I understood and I believe now that pharmacy school is hard. I need to study every single thing and I don't need to worry about it. I need to care a lot about my health. Uh, at the same time I study a lot so that's it thank you so much for watching if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel see you in the next one take care goodbye